Hey yo, hey yo, everybody, Kidvo here, and I am back in Sea of Flame, what should we call it? It's darkness, lots of darkness, just a lot of darkness. <laughs> but I've resupplied a bit more, and got a bit more supplies, I think I remember there was a fun box. Fun box or fun box. Around here, that I lit up last time. Spider. There's a spider spawning down there, and it seems that there's a couple of spawners embedded in the ground down there because I see stuff spawning. I'm gonna take a glance around and see if I can. Oh! Found some of of use. I think these are a couple of the. <laughs> the Vex exclusive fun box. I hear a zombie out there. Which, which is this? No, oh, that's my thing. I saw off in the distance a weird thing then, and I didn't know what it was. It's apparently one of the things I made myself, so I'm just an idiot. I hear a zombie. Where is he? Oh, probably down there. Um. One thing, uh, one of the mobs that I, I don't like very much are whoa one spiders and two creepers and I had a lag spike in the middle of that so I'm just going to continue running and jumping uh, spiders a spider on stairs easy that's one of the things that I do kind of like about uh, having performance problems while doing this is not fun at all. I'm a bit more armor on this time, if only barely. And uh, there goes my good sword. Uh, yeah, I got a bit of encounter on this. Not much because I ran out of levels. And they're back. And spider. Spiders! Lag! It does not help. Lag really does not help. Ow. I don't know if I mentioned it last episode, but I'm not going to be upgrading to 1.3 for a while since. <clears throat> well, they did improve performance, but they also stuck a server on the end of it. In my mind, anyway, so. And that gets rid of the performance. Hi. You're not attacking me. So when I realised while I was on my way back back here after collecting the resources, this is a max spawn area due to the fact up there is just lava. Yeah. Lava and torch is in fact. Hi Enderman. You won't bug me with you. I have problems with lag, quite a lot of them. At some point in this, by the end of this year, I hope to have a new PC. Could allow me to record a bit better as well, considering the fact this is perhaps the most shabbiest of setups I could ever, ever have. By that I mean seriously, my mic is currently positioned behind me on the bookcase. Creeper, back off. Creepers are like mocking you by the way. By the way, never expect a creeper to not blow up. Always expect it that it might blow up. It saves you a lot of heartache they get through. Like that. 
You can be out of range of them and everything, but they still might blow up because they do... Ow, that sent me flying. I went absolutely flying there. That was kind of cool. Get back here. Get back here, spiders. Ah, ah. Fight the, fight the skellies. Fight the skellies. Back the creeper. I'm surprised I killed the creeper. Ow. I'm out. I'm running low on hunger. <laughs> I'm fairly good at jumping though. That can help. Currently my strategy is run in, place, place torches, run away. Um, all the times before I've been tunneling a lot and I'm thinking that I may be boring you guys slightly. Uh, oh yeah, I brought some mushrooms. Um, what was I looking for? I cannot remember what I was looking for. I feel like an idiot. some more torches in this max spawn area already max spawn area plunk more torches down make this make the remaining areas even more max spawn oh my I saw you there we go clear that and you, I'll have to use my smite sword I brought a lot of swords, just in case, well, just in case they all start breaking. Which they have, so I give that a smart idea. A lot of enemies around, it really is. Don't want to be fighting with them that much, but I can take them if I need to. And point, 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 point. Oh, that's kind of, that's kind of useful. I saw you, creeper. I'm doing little runs with torches. Torches are fun. Oop, 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 oop. No. I like running backwards because it's easier to make sure that creepers don't attack you. For some reason I could not fire my bow then. I don't like facing creepers in melee combat. They have a chance of spontaneously exploding just to just to annoy you in all my prior experiences in in Minecraft in ways. Flying And oh the lag. Oh the lag. Oh the lag. If you guys didn't notice I'm trying to be much more active with you guys. Talking a lot more. Which is like against my natural reactions because in, in real life I'm very quiet normally. Oh, I knocked a torch off. A poor torch. I didn't even know what it is. Dark spot. Wait, what's my brightness setting? 80%. That seems good. I could turn off smooth lighting to get a perfect view because that uh, having the fancy lighting on uh, means that we can't see exactly which squares and how dark they are because my god at the things. I heard you skeleton. Ow. That wasn't fair. Sad face. Oh, you were up there. Oh, I looked at the Enderman. I looked at the Enderman. I looked at the Enderman. That... That's a problem. Get him. Get him. There we go. Got him. And... Cut bones. Bonk. And... 
island. That's still a lot of stuff over there. Got the same as past. Haha, <laughs> I keep forgetting to make like a timer or something. To remind me when I started. You know one of these days when I end up making an hour long video just because I forget that I started an hour early. Or something like that. I think it's been like 10 minutes, I think. Make a bit of progress there. And, well, I'm not known for my great timekeeping skills. Like, if you actually watch my, um, uh, Flatland Survivor, uh, Quest for the Never, you would know that I have absolutely terrible timekeeping skills. Ow. That's the reason why you have to always make sure that you're a couple of blocks away from the creeper. If that's something that happen, might happen like that and make you... Could make you die if you decide to stay near anything. I always expect creepers to explode. Like that. Also, thanks for damaging the zombie creeper. Also, most people think creepers are just generally unuseful. They are very useful. You can use them to dig. You can use them to blow up enemies. They're like walking bombs. You can you can use that. Because what else would you be able to do? Because well, you can make them. A, you can make things die with other things. Friendly fire. And oh, I just fell down that hole. I hate spiders. <laughs> In real life as well, I have arachnophobia. Uh, da -da 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 -da. You may wonder why I keep replacing these balls. It's because at one point I'm probably going to forget that. Forget to refill them, go to swap it in, not look at it, and then end up having an empty bowl on my bar. Not realising, I'll probably go into combat, look at my hunger meter, see that I'm very low on hunger, and go to eat it, and then realise, and then probably die. What am I doing? Seriously, what was I doing then? I forgot. Oh! And a hole. There we are. Bit more headway. Oh, hi. Uh, doop. Roll, roll. I think smite works on undead things, which I think a skeleton is. If a skeleton is not, then I'm very surprised. Since when were skeletons non undead things? Oh! There's a fun box there, I think. Vex, why did you put a fun box in the wall? I got that spider in midair, I feel awesome now. Ooh. What hit me? Some people may ask why I put torches everywhere and not really care, it's because the fact I can easily get more coal with that mining pick of awesomeness and the fact I have a tree farm and metric ton of wood and if a creeper does that then I have less chance of spawning to appear because if I have a max spawn condition and the creeper does say this and there's a spawner nearby that's like asking something to happen that's wrong you missed there buddy it hit me then, though. Okay, well, I think there's a fun box in there. Oh, hi, creepers. I go flying again. Just die, spider. I'm surprised I got him then. Really am. Enderman, my fun friend. 
Why are there zombies there? Not sure. Did I say zombie? Yes. Hi, zombie. Hi. I like the stone swords. They're kind of useful. And you can get some very good encounters on them. Uh, most people think iron is like one of the best tools you can get. It's and diamond. Well, diamond is the best tool you can get, mm -hmm. but stone is a very, very useful tool that you can mass produce. Like, say, that happened. I lost my sword. In a matter of seconds, I could probably make a new sword if I was fast. Fast. Oh, hi. Uh, look backwards and and jump backwards, punch. Gets the stairs, gets the stairs, gets the stairs. The stairs are the point where the spiders get weaker. Uh, is the stairs here? Where were the stairs? There's the stairs. And stop it. Spiders have trouble on the stairs. I found that out a while ago. It's kind of it's kind of a useful tip. So if you want to engage engage spiders, try to make stairs. They have problems going up them and attacking. They can do their lunge thing still, which can cause lots of problems for you. Actually it's deteriorate spawning on this side. I was expecting a creep to be right beside me. That creeper over there. As I said, always expect creeps to explode. Because when you expect them not to explode, like there, explode, explode. How long have I been saying explode? I don't know. But whenever you expect them not to explode, they will explode just to spite you. There went something. I think that was the man pants. If you don't know, the man pants is a reference to. A YouTuber named Zisto. He's a very awesome YouTuber, by the way. I reckon I recommend watching his videos and maybe even subscribing to him. And uh, maybe even subscribing to him. He's one of the reasons that I started this channel. Um, but it's a reference to Zisto because he, well, he would go, yes, man punch, yes, yes, man punch, yes, lag, lagging, lag. But he didn't do the lagging thing. Yeah, it wasn't man. Punch. Oh, my level two is almost gone. Face. Put these in the proper position. If um, run out of torches as well. I, mean, I might have to go for another trip. Lol. <laughs> Hopefully not. Oh, food swapped out and more mushroom soup put in bar. Yes. Ga. Ga. Lag. Lag. Enderman. 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 There we go. That lag did not help. It made that encounter a lot more terrifying because I didn't know if I was going to hit him or not, or if I might have another brief fight with the lag mon with the lag gods. I swear there is a god out there that just makes lag. Oh, that is a pick. That is a pick fool. And there goes my tunic. Didn't get very close. Did I hit him? I'm lagging again. Lagging again. One, FP one FPS. One FPS. Because this is max spawn conditions, that is always problematic. Zombies hit very hard, by the way. You didn't know that. How? Okay, I need to put torch up there. Still in regen territory, but not for much longer. Eh, there. Eh. Torches. Torches are fun. Torches are lots of fun. Ow. Why? Why, skeleton? Why? Okay, I we need the health and I'm out of regen territory. I think. 
I had a creeper. Where's the creeper? 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 Where's the creeper?
I hope this build is playing that if I can move fast enough. Okay. Ooh, that could have ended badly. I could have ended straight in the lava, which would have ended in disaster and tears and sad face. As I said, I hate spiders. Ow. These skeletons could block, you could take up a bit more of the damage. Oh yeah. Uh, all I have is food. I do not have any, any more healy thingies. Um, I have keys. That's all I have to do for now. Suppose it is a waste of a regen potion. That and the fact I don't know how to make potion. Oh, iron. That trapped. Most likely. And that was a ping pong between me and the skeleton. Between the zombie and the skeleton. And there goes my remaining piece of armor. This is going to be a disaster. With armor, you don't need to worry about skeletons as much. Without armor, you have to worry a lot. Because they can utterly murder you and they can attack you while you're retreating. I do not trust these blocks. Either way, I'm still in health regen territory. I'm going to regen some health back here. I know there's a creeper following me. I saw him. I'll plant some torches around here just in case. And how many arrows do I have? 14. I can take out that food. And that's done. Ooh, don't look at the Enderman. An Enderman at this point would utterly that would utterly murder me. Yeah, I really need to get some more armor. Come on. Come on, experience. I like the experience. Experience is helpful. Gives me enchantments, which save me for longer. Something I've been curious about is the enchantment system. What does it do to your weapons and armor? Because I found that with enchanted armor, they seem to go down a lot faster, but with unenchanted stuff, uh, with enchanted weapons, it doesn't do anything to your durability. Can somebody clarify that for me? Because for me, it really does look like enchanted um, armor it seems to break a lot quicker than just normal armor. Don't look at the Enderman, K. Okay? Don't look at the Enderman. Couple. At this point, I do know that an Enderman would utterly murder my face, and I would have lots of problems. Okay, I'm just going to advance slowly. I do not trust any of his iron. A bit more experience. Experience. Oh, skeleton, skeleton, skeleton. Sideways jump, sideways jump, and we uh, take him out from all the range. I think it may have been about 30 minutes now, I'm not sure. As I said, worst timekeeper in history here. That's a fire arrow. Congratulations, skeleton, you've gained fire. Um, oh, missed. Hit him then. Got him. A complete investment for the arrows. Thank you, Mr. Skeleton. Mm -hmm. nice skeleton over there. Oh, he just shot the Enderman. But unfortunately, Enderman cannot be killed by projectile weaponry because they just teleport. I don't think they even aggro on you. Ow. Um, okay. Down. Swoop. Hole. Yeah, I'm really running low on supplies, but I've made so much progress here. I don't really want. I don't really want to end it here. I need to break that. I need to put some torches back here, even if this is all traps. Which I'm now starting to doubt that it 
is all trapped. I'm gonna need to um make sure mobs don't spawn in it and aka like a creeper to ruin my day. I'm gonna gather enough iron for three things. Sorry if you heard that through the mic, I don't know what that was, but something just went click. I don't know what it was. Something in my house. I think it was the bottle. Yes, there was a plastic bottle. I was out earlier. Uh, I had to buy a bottle of drinks. Oh, don't look at the enemy. Well, I was mining that block. Okay, how much iron ore do I have? How much do I have? Where is it? 20. Oh, it's on my health bar. That helps. Give me two. Okay, I need... It's 24 for armor, 9 for... 9 for... I think it's 24 for armor. I can't remember. 9 for... Um... What's it called? The block. I don't know how many copper tools because I didn't know if I want the tools here. Uh, where they are? I have 42. Should be enough for now. Take off these two. Oh, these three. And. Well, I'm gonna head back, get myself some armor and what's not though because I think you guys want me to do this. Tax tolls! I do know that method for um, fighting Enderman. I try and do it but I usually don't have enough concentration in the heat of combat. Except when I'm the one in full control of said combat. But either way I'm gonna return from here and I'm going to Cook up those materials that you saw earlier. Um, get a bit more coal from. Yeah, because I have 13 torches and a bit more. I'm gonna. Well, cook up that iron and put block on the monument. So I'll see you guys once I've done that. Hey, oh, hey, I am back at my encampment at the Victory Monument. I realised that I had another music desk. Sure, I think it was. And, well, I've now got my iron block. That's the first block on this monument. Oh, yeah. Um, I have the armors. The armors are awesome. It's now iron. Yeah, my armor. Take off the hell for a second. Um, I have very little inventory space. <laughs> Um, yeah, uh, well, put this iron block on the monument and boom, there we go. So another thing on this monument down and there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen things left to go. I've now gotten five. Two, ah, three, ah. All the things. Well, I have ten spare iron. I might make a sword or something like that. But either way, I went on a little mining trip on my way back. I now have more coal. I was running low on it before. But, well, I think the only thing left to say for this episode is... Farewell for now.